Good afternoon, friends. Today, I will tell you how to add your app to the App Store, namely the first part of this process, creating an iOS application on Andromo and submitting it to the App Store for a test flight. For your application to be added to the App Store, it must first go through testing. Therefore, our steps to add the app to the App Store will lead us, first of all, to the test flight section. Here, you can add internal and external testers to your app. After the app is added to the test flight, you can start preparing it for the App Store release. The video about it is already on our channel, and the link will be in the description of this video. So to get started, you will need to make a few preparations. First, you will need to download the Xcode program from the App Store. Without it, you won't be able to manage apps and add them to the App Store. You will need about 12 gigabytes of disk space and several hours to download Xcode. So start downloading it right now. This application is free. After you download Xcode, you will also need the Transporter app. After you put Xcode on download, you go to developer.apple.com. Here you will have to register and pay $99. This is the price you need to pay once a year if you want to publish apps on the App Store. After you buy a developer.apple.com account, you can start adding your app to the App Store. First, let's create it. Let's go to Easy Start Andromo and choose the app. For example, Fairy Tales from the ebook section. We add it to our projects and go to Settings, iOS Settings. Press Get Certificate Request and download the file. After that, we go to developer.apple.com account. Press Certificate Identifiers and Profiles. Create a new certificate. If the maximum number of certificates is generated, you can revoke any unused certificates. Also, you can use an existing certificate for a new app. Now, let's create a new certificate. Choose Apple Distribution. Upload our certificate request file. download our certificate. Upload developer certificate to our project. Now we need a mobile provisioning certificate. To do this, again, go to the developer's Apple dashboard. Click Identifiers. Create a new identifier. Choose App IDs. Press App and Continue. Type in your project description and app package name. Click Continue and Register. We can see that the identifier has been added. Now we go to Profiles and create a new provisioning profile. Choose App Store and press Continue. Find our project in the Apple ID drop-down. Choose the certificate we created previously. Give the name to the provisioning profile. Press Generate and Download. Upload Provision Certificate to your project at Andromo.
Now we can save and create an app. While the app is being built, we need to add it to appstoreconnect.apple.com. We need to log in here with our app developer account credentials. Enter my apps, click new app. Enter your app name. Choose iOS. Select language. Choose bundle ID from the drop-down list. Create a unique ID. Choose full access. Your app name has to be unique for the App Store. After the app is built, we need to upload it to the test flight section using the transporter program. Our application is built and we can download it. Now let's open the transporter app. Add our app to the transporter. Press deliver. After delivery is complete, our app will be available at the App Store Connect test flight section. The app is delivered. You can ignore the warning. Now we go to the test flight section. Let's create an internal testing group. And add app users. We have to wait a couple of minutes until the build appears after the transporter delivery. Well, the app is uploaded. The tester should check his email and accept the invitation for testing. After successful testing, you can head to the App Store section and prepare your app for the store release. There is already a video about this. The link to it will be in the description of this video. That's all I wanted to tell you today. Thank you for your attention and good luck!